The food fight between apples and blackberries rages on, but what do smartphone owners really think about their devices? You're about to find out. I'm Jim Woods. This is the ChangeWave Hotwire. ChangeWave's recent smartphone survey showed an evolving two-horse race between Apple's iPhone and Research in Motion's BlackBerry, with second-tier players like Palm's Trio being pushed to the sidelines. To find out more about what's fueling the race between Apple and RIM, we took a closer look at which features smartphone users like and dislike the most. Our survey showed that the overall satisfaction levels are highest for the two smartphone frontrunners, with the iPhone boasting a 79% very satisfied rating, while the BlackBerry garnered a highly respectable 54%. Nokia came in third, with Motorola and Palm rounding out the list. But what is it about the top two smartphone brands keeping customers so happy? Let's start by looking at the BlackBerry. By a huge margin, owners say that the BlackBerry's exceptional access to email is the feature they like the best. Respondents cited the integration and seamless way the BlackBerry works with their corporate email systems as the biggest reason to like the device. As for the feature BlackBerry owners dislike the most, Number one was the quality of the internet browsing experience. Both the speed of the browser and the lack of access to some websites were cited as the biggest drawbacks. Another key dislike for BlackBerry users is the small keypad, with owners saying the typing feature makes it difficult to avoid errors. Turning now to the iPhone, when it comes to the feature owners like the most, number one was the integration of telephone, iPod, and internet browser. The second most liked feature is the iPhone's touchscreen interface. Ease of use was the third biggest reason why owners say they like their iPhones. And what did iPhone owners dislike about the device? Overwhelmingly, it was the speed of AT&T's Edge network. Now it should come as no surprise that the number two criticism of the iPhone is Apple's requirement to use the AT&T network as the exclusive service provider. Users also cited the iPhone's lack of copy and paste functionality as something they disliked the most. We probed a little deeper to get a sense of some of the other issues surrounding the iPhone, including what features users would like to see added. Among current iPhone owners, nearly one in five say the feature they'd like to see is 3G capability. A slightly smaller group would like to have access to third-party software. And with Apple's recent release of the software development kit, it shouldn't be long before we see a slew of new applications hitting the market when the 2.0 version of the iPhone operating system becomes available. There's no denying the iPhone has captured the hearts and minds of its user base, but then again, so is the BlackBerry. With the core strengths of both the iPhone and the BlackBerry intact, it's safe to say that the smartphone battle is likely to rage on for some time to come. I'm Jim Woods, and this has been the ChangeWave Hotwire.